I like you a lot, but I, I think that's the last tape of you having sex with your girlfriend I want to see. Sorry again. Oof. Cancer. Car accident. No, no, I know. I just, I'm just it's saying it feels like everyone's getting cancer. Creepy. What a s Rocky relationship. <laughs> Come on, Brian. Don't comment or like it. It's a hard lesson, but one he has to learn. Okay, they're obviously home. You'd have to be dumb to try to rob that place. Oh, yes! Hey, Stewie, it's me. You got a second? Brian? Uh, hang on. Hey, keep it down, you screwballs. You and your friends say screwball a lot. That's what happens when you run with a screwy crowd. <laughs> What's up with you? What are you talking about? I think I saw him getting rid of her body and, and carrying a bag with something heavy in it, and, and there was red liquid dripping from it. You could snag a couple of rolls of toilet paper, could you? Stewie? I'm here. I just wanted you to have to sit with those words for a minute. Stewie, thank God you're here. There's a seagull in your hallway. Listen, what are we going to do about this Principal Shepherd thing? You're building this whole theory of... What is that noise? It's a news alert. Has been reported missing. Oh my god, maybe he did do it. You know, there are some bad people in this world. Um, G-string underwear. No, it's Don't Talk About Fight Club. Oh, well, I really blew it. So, you plan on going back at that banana, huh? So the bastard killed his wife and then reported her missing. Go hog police. Joe, Joe, it's Brian. Listen, I have to tell you something. I'm, I'm pretty sure Principal Shepard killed his wife. Rank suspicion born out of boredom and loneliness. Sorry, that's just not enough for us to go on. What? I've been using this eye cream. It's done wonders for me. It's made by a company called Rodan and Fields. Have you heard of them, Brian? Joe, I gotta run. I'm hosting a little get-together tomorrow night if you want to stop by. There's gonna be pizza and soft drinks. Then a man's gonna talk about the whole line. And try to find some evidence that he did it. All right, fine, but you have to be careful. Don't worry, he won't have any idea. I'll be more discreet than a guy standing by himself in the ocean. I'm just trying to enjoy the day. Why don't you go bother that guy? Summer's blown by, huh? All right, he's gone. Now, if I give the word, you've got to get out of there, okay? Got it. He sleeps in a bunk bed. Are you kidding me? Who is this guy? Wait a second. Is that... Bri, I'm gonna put you down for a sec. Stewie, no, don't! Stewie, get out of there! Stewie! Stewie! You gotta get his attention. Mm. Medium pie, ten wings. Is the blue cheese dressing in there? Thanks a lot. Have a good one. Stewie, he saw you. He saw you leaving his apartment. Oh. Well, so what? He doesn't know what we're doing. Well, that's... that's not good. Okay, that's probably a principle. Then what is it? Well, I'm, um, I'm actually doing a documentary about some of the finest principles in the country. And? Brian! Stewie, help me! You'd have to go back a little while. We're not doing that! I found this in a dumpster behind Principal Shepard's building. That's it! Th that's, that's the bag! I guarantee his wife's in there. What's the matter, Rook? Too heavy for you? I've actually been a cop for years. I have tummy cancer. But, but I saw... What is all this? Principal Shepard, I think you've got some explaining to do. You ever heard of a company called Rodan and Fields? Oh my god, Brian, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Annie, are you okay? So, Annie, are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? That was fun, Mom. We don't get to do a lot of that kind of stuff together. Listen, Brian, we want you to come home again. No, but the school board hero dog is. It was all over the papers. You saved the school $206 from all the food they recovered from Principal Shepard's fridge. Of course we do. Hey, where's everyone else? Oh, God. <clears throat> uh... 
Yes. And no Trump questions. Okay. I have nothing else to ask you. I can't believe I'm stuck in an elevator with God! Although I guess you are everywhere and in all places. No, you're thinking of Kevin Hart. You know, his real name is Dwayne Johnson. Yeah, I know. We have Us Weekly on Earth, too. Wait, why are you here? Shouldn't you be up in heaven? How did I get here? Well, you had a couch attached to your back, and you fell down the stairs and hit your head pretty hard. Man, this thing is really stuck. Hey, can you use your god powers to get us out? No, they don't really work in elevators. I always dreamed of being stuck in an elevator with Tom Brady. That makes two of us. Um, god, here's something you might be able to tell me. Will Taylor Swift and Katy Perry ever reconcile their differences? Some people say we're just a computer simulation run by a higher species. Is that true? It is. Ben Aykroyd, Morwenna Banks, Vanessa Don Lovitz, Bayer. Norm MacDonald, Gail Mathias. Gail Mathias, good pull. Michael McKeon. Wow! Now do kids in the hall. That was five guys, Peter. Name them. I can't. As past human lives or as animals? Both. Who have I been? You were Henry VIII. Wow! Let me finish. I like to believe there's something bigger than me out there keeping a watch out. Different people think different things. I'm kind of like a nanny cam. She would say, God is love. I always liked that. That's nice, Peter. God and love are very similar concept. Man, when are they going to fix this elevator? It's not broken. I just haven't decided where it's going yet. It's like a loge. Well, what's a loge? Oh, hey, what's with all the questions? Yeah, you don't know either. I feel like the bones in her back would hurt my tummy. Well, if you weren't dead, would you feel nothing when I do this? Ah, son of a bitch! Uh, you know what? That's right. It takes a day. My, my bad. Sorry. Please, he played that for all it was worth. Why has thou forsaken me? You know what? I did him a favor. I'll show you how good a husband and father I can be. Are you asking for a second chance? I, I guess so. I'll give you one day to prove to me that your family is better off with you alive. I'll return you to your life before you were in a coma. I know how you always wanted kittens, so guess what I brought home? This very pregnant, about to burst, distended nipple street cat. Oh, cat, she doesn't want to be around people right now. She needs a quiet space to have a kitten. But I understand the instinct. Now, we all need to do our part to help with the birth. Meg, boil some water. Brian, get some clean rags. Chris, blankets. Dewey, band-aids for me. Well, look at us, out for a fun family dinner. If anyone's watching, they'd say, look at that family. Look how happy they are. Well, the kids do love fun ruckus. All right, let's start this again. You're all gonna get up, go back up to that Toppins bar, and go nuts. But it tastes good like this. It's not supposed to be easy to eat. Half of it is supposed to fall onto your plate when you squeeze it, and the rest goes onto your shirt. How's everything going over here? Terrible. Go away. Salt shaker, whatever. Ice from soda, get on that burger. Peter, people are staring. Yeah, they're saying, look at the creative guy. That's also fun ruckus. Get used to it. And prepare to fish my teeth out of my stool. Peter, enough. You guys clearly don't get it. Those poor kids, those poor babies. Hey, Chris, what do you got there? A plain burger. Looks good. Dad, can you crack your window a little bit? I hate you all so much! Uh-oh. Kids, let's go inside. Before you go, there's something I want to say. Not the board game, which I quite enjoy. Okay. And Meg, I'm sorry I'll never get a chance to walk you down the aisle. It kills me that I'll never see you become a man. Loving Twink. Is anyone gonna stop him? And Chris, whenever you're feeling defeated... Sorry, you were the last one. What about me? You're a dog. Peter, what's going on? Why are you saying these things? Sorry, why don't you guys go inside? I'm supposed to get her a week from Thursday, but I may be moving that up. I suppose you know why I'm here. But since then, it's just killing, killing, killing. Well, go ahead and do it. My family would be better off without me. Say that again. You were right about everything. That's all I needed to hear. That's what religion is. I'm not gonna die? Nope, not for another four years. Thank you, God. Bless you, my child. Hey, Chris, you like pictures of naked children because you're gross and weird. Well, I'm sorry about Fuddruckers. It won't happen again. Because nothing means more to me than my family. Oh, Peter, that's wonderful. Well, looks like quitting time. Good night, Kirk Cameron. Rises, James Broke. 
Mamma mia!